Welcome to another Business Tech Planet video. Today we'll show you how to pin an email in the web, desktop, and mobile versions of Outlook. In the classic desktop version of Outlook, the only way to pin an email is to flag it. Flagging an email will create a to-do item, that will remind you to follow up with the email. To do that, hover over the email and click the flag icon. Alternatively, right-click the flag icon to reveal more options. Here, you can select a certain date for when the email needs to be followed up. Or simply set a reminder. You can also access the flag options from the top menu. We're going to select a custom date. You can name the flag. Set a start and end time for completion date. And set a reminder. When you're done, hit OK. But if that's not what you wanted, you can turn on the new look in the top right. When the dialog box appears, hit switch. You'll notice that the new look is more like the web version of Outlook. So when you hover over the email, you now have the option to pin it. You can also right click the email and select pin or unpin. And you now have a pin icon next to the flag at the top, which you can use to pin your selected emails. In the web version of Outlook, you can pin emails using the same methods as the desktop's new look. Here, we can hover over the email, and click the pin icon. You can also select multiple emails. Then right-click any of them, and select pin or unpin from the menu. The pin icon is blue for pinned items, and if you click them again, you'll unpin the email. You can also select emails, and use the icon in the top menu to pin or unpin them. In the mobile version of Outlook, you can pin an email by pressing and holding on an email. That will bring up some options at the top. There, tap the three dots. And then select pin from the drop-down. To unpin an email, long press again on the email. Tap the three dots. And then select unpin. That's all for this video. If you found it helpful, why not buy us a coffee? We'd really appreciate it. And, you'd be helping us grow the channel. Remember to check the description for additional links and resources. And don't forget to subscribe for more Microsoft videos.